oh guys um today is the 18th and i have my new appointment today my nails look so tacky right now i cannot wait to get it done my appointment is by two and it's 9 a.m now but i'm traveling i have a wedding in um cross river on 22nd so i'm leaving on the 20th so i basically have today and tomorrow to get a lot of things done do my christmas shopping for the house you know stock up on things for the kids as we're traveling we're going to the village and then um get my hair done my nails everything li like literally i have a lot to do so i'm just going to start by going um house shopping now just a little bit of house shopping then from there i'll go get my pedicure done and weave my hair in a salon then i'm going to a nail shop to do my nails from there so yeah basically i'm going to have a very busy day and welcome to another vlog of course subscribe if you haven't already um like comment share you know the drill okay um yeah so let's just go let's go <music> you guys so i just bought keeper because see when it comes to shaving for me if i am not waxing i'm using clipper why, why have i been pointing the camera at so yes if it's not waxing it's clipper because when i use like blades like shaving sticks or shaving creams it gives me a lot of bumps and i realized that late in life so yeah i've worked so hard to clear like my bumps and all that so right now i just use clipper to shave it doesn't like shave it as clean as like blades would but you know it does the job and yeah from time to time i still wax anyway so guys i think i'm done buying the things i need to buy from here oh not a lot i bought not a lot i am estimating like thirty thousand naira worth of products so i'm going to check out now um what's the time Hold on. i have to get to the salon to do my pedicure this is christmas season so i'm guessing there'll be rush so i want to go early so that when i finish early i'll go to my new place early as well my camera out thank god some people don't like me getting their face i usually ask if i want to okay video people's faces but i carry my camera out a lot <laughs> you'll be happy okay now i can show your face <laughs> yes, really nice yes <laughs> if you come to next cash and carry look for her What's the yeah, name, please? Blessing. My blessing. Blessing. Don't look at this is my passport. You are hiding it because of the picture. It's not fine. This is why I'm telling you. Well, you look fine in person. So, your makeup is nice too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
so guys I just finished doing my nails and well I've not done my nails yet I did my pedicure and painted my toe because I did that at a different salon and now I'm going to like a nail tech to do my nails but before then I have to rush home I just like this customer I've disappointed a number of times and I just couldn't disappoint her today. I really couldn't. I didn't even weave my hair again because I had to rush back to prep something for her. There are two people actually send it out before I um, what's it called? Go and fix my nails. And my nails, my appointment is at two, and it's almost twelve now. So I literally have like one hour, thirty minutes to do everything I need to do and get myself there because I need to leave my house like thirty minutes before because it's not really close to my house. So yeah, that's how my day is going. Literally, like my day is packed. You guys, nothing I hate more than seeing kids that walk. It's just so sad, and I don't know. It just really touches me most of the time because maybe because I have kids and I can't even imagine seeing or letting my children just hawk something on the streets under this hot sun in this country just selling things it's just it's not something I want for any child sincerely speaking they are just too young to be going through that kind of hardship at that age most times I see children hawking I just call them and just dash the money like just do the little I can at the moment at least it's just a sad thing I just don't want boy one small boy maybe like five years selling egg on the streets you know and it's just um it's unfortunate i blame their parents even though some people say oh the parents don't have any other choice but see we always have other choices okay a five-year-old is definitely way too young to walk on the streets what are your thoughts personally i just think they are too young and you know you can find other ways to make money you can do it yourself I don't know I mean I don't know their background or where they're coming from so I don't want to over judge but I can't help but just judge a little bit so guys I just finished doing my nails and I absolutely love this nails like look at how pretty just look at how pretty they are um yes I love it many hours later so guys these ogres are eating look at them <laughs> they are eating rice she's feeding them rice and I got this package on the mail today this is something I ordered from one Instagram account that sells shoes for big feet um, I can't remember their name right now so I ordered these sandals and I'm excited to see what it looks like oh guys these are what the sandals look like they are the same sandals but in two different colors by the way they added, added a complimentary bag for me this bag is going to be so useful because I can throw in a lot into this bag I'm going to put their Instagram account on the screen right now I think I discovered them through Yummy Mom Life um, Chinye, she always posts about them because she gets shoes there because she has big feet as well so I tried them out and I must say I am kind of impressed this is the sandals I ordered hold on let me bring the second one out it's just a very basic simple sandals and yeah so this is what the black one looks like it's just very basic my legs are really long you guys can see it's almost coming out a little bit here but i'm still going to wear them like this one. to find my size is so hard and this is what the red one looks like basic simple nice you guys i'm very happy with this i bought each of them four thousand eight hundred naira. so yeah that's a fair enough price it's, it's fair enough for this kind of sandals okay guys so it's Thursday morning and I am on my way I look weird and I am my, on my way to Cross River and um, yeah Francis is dropping me at the park before going to work and see here yeah, Marilyn if you're watching this I, I don't think I've entered public transport in like I don't know how long 10 15 years and from nowhere this year alone I've entered public transport for you to go to Abba first of all and now and again to cross river and back because it just seems like the faster option and I really don't know anybody that I really trust to drive me in my car and also yeah I just I don't know I just feel like it's a bit easier to just enter public transport obviously I'm going to pay for 
like two or three seats so that I don't have anybody get an Ichima who like I'll be rubbing their dirty body on my on me. <laughs> it's so funny. Francis Francis is just he's indifferent about the whole thing, but hey, it's happening. And he's going to drop me at the park and then um go to work. And he made me share my location on WhatsApp already, so he's going to be monitoring my location for the next eight hours till I get to where I'm going to. Updates that I wasn't able to do before. Point of story is we entered the car, we moved for about one hour, and the car spoiled. See, yeah, this is my biggest fear with entering public transport this whole car spoiling thing. And the car spoiled, and we were stranded on the road for one freaking hour. But immediately the thing happened, I called Francis, so he started coming. Obviously, he got a driver from work and um, they started coming to meet us you know he came with an extra car so that he'd be able to go back so at the end of the day i still had to travel with my car look at that's my car behind obviously we just bought well we're already at enugu now and i feel so bad i feel like god actually put me in that car to be able to help people today because i had to pick up one woman who has had three kids with her and another really old lady if not they would have been all be stranded on the road Obviously, I don't even know if the car has left there now because what was wrong with the car? They needed to go back Buy some things. It was a serious problem. So anyways, just a quick update. We're still on our way I will drop them pretty soon because they're going to Enugu, but I have to continue to Ogoja So I'll drop them soon because we're already at Enugu um, Yeah, we're at the police station now. So quick update. I'll see you guys when I get there You should ask me. Yeah, put anybody in your blood. You must pay We have a blood See, he doesn't know me. Uh, he does not know me. She didn't tell me now. See, he doesn't even know me. Guys, I want to to my channel. Oh my god. You know me? I did. I did. I Literally, that's how I start every video. Anyway, guys. My parents, my parents. <laughs> Today I'm going to show you how she wants to be sure the magic. That girl magic. Why you draw the tea like this and go here? So, bride, our beautiful bride, our runaway bride. I ran away. She ran to Canada and left us here to suffer. Come, come and show this. Why are you not doing with innocent girl face? We know your real self. <laughs> oh, it's too late. I'm sure I entered. I'm going to zoom into it. Oh, this is really looking good in pictures. So guys, we are setting up for Mel's <laughs> Oh yeah, I need to plug my phone. For her bridal shower. This was supposed to be a surprise, but some people spoiled it. <laughs> Come and show your face. One of the people, but yeah, it's perfect. We'll get. We'll find something. Who is that? Meme. Are you alone? Come in, come in, come in. Oh, see, look at how pretty this looks. I'm so excited. What's we're still setting up. It's here. Mokaki. It's here. See her. We're still setting up. This is the person helping us to achieve this greatness. Yeah. I'm going to put her number and yes and everything in the description box. It's so cute. It's so nice. Just look at my face. I've not had my bath all day. We've been running around, doing a lot of things. Um, see, eh, in my, you're going to my car. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my car is even here. I thought it was far. And um, please, my wallet from the pigeon hole. There's a concealer and eye pencil inside my wallet. Please. Stop. 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 Yes. See, you guys, I'm really excited. I can't see how this turns out. I am so excited. Oh my god. It looks so good. So good, beautiful. This yes, this is the video. This is the rice we're about to eat. Say hi to my vlog. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> oh, and this is this area. 
and I feel like I should do small makeup. I don't know, but maybe this is our decor extraordinaire. Yeah, love and treasures. Yes, love and treasures. <laughs> love and treasures. That's yeah. Favorite water. I think it should be written favorite apple drink and favorite. Hey, bride. Hey. You're playing games. When I like that white one that I wrote there, it's not the white one. See what I do. It's true. Before. <laughs> <laughs> Every time, why am I money? Hello, baby, I'm busy. You don't even know what you do to me. Your back, your love, your back, your love. 